Got to do a little guided meditation today on a, a different technique than what most people run across. This is one that comes out of the um, tradition that we talk about in Yoga Nidra, but it's also used in many other different approaches in non-duality. The idea is to look at comparing two different poles and looking back and forth between those and then trying to see if you can see the space. You can hold those two together at the same time, separately, but simultaneously. And if you can look at what's in between those when you're holding these completely there and switching back and forth looking for the still space behind and underneath that. So we'll do that little exercise, a little meditation here. Close your eyes, get your back straight, not ramrod straight, but just try to get your hips high enough so that your shoulders are somehow over your hips. It makes it a lot easier, it makes your breath a lot smoother. Let your breath be very long and slow. Just feel yourself sinking into your breath, focusing on your exhales. Exhale longer, inhale, It'll be longer, smoother. Keep feeling your exhales going long, slow. And watch where the exhale falls away. What does it go into? Just breath after breath, feel this inhale, and then this long, slow exhale sliding off at the end into what? Feel that space at the end of the exhale. Breath within your capacity, long, slow, smooth. Feel your body relaxing as you settle into your exhale. See if you can find at the end of the exhale where it goes into, you can feel the beginning of the next inhale. Feel where the inhale comes from. And do several breaths looking at this where the exhale goes and where the inhale comes from. And as you become comfortable with that, recognize how your consciousness has changed in a very short time. Things have changed. I'd like to do a an interesting exercise here that comes out of these some of these traditions. This is now as you sit here, breathing, focusing on your breath. Focus on just one side to breathe through. You don't need to manipulate your hands like we often do in yoga. Just feel yourself breathing just through your left nostril. And attend, pay attention only to the sensations in the left side of your body. Feel how your left side of your body feels compared to how it felt before and how it feels in comparison to the right side of the body. Keep your attention focused on the left. Keep breathing through the left nostril, long and slow. Feel how your sensations change. And now shift your attention to the right nostril and the right side of the body. Breathe just through the right nostril and the right side of the body. 
attending just to the sensations on the right side of the body. Feel how the right side changes as you shifted your attention, shifted your breath. Does it really feel as if you are now breathing more through the right nostril? As you become comfortable on the right side of the body, feel what's happening to consciousness. And now again, shift your attention back to the left nostril and the left side of the body, letting go of the right side. Feel how it changes with this focus on the left side. And now shift your attention over to the right side again, your right nostril, feeling the movement from left to right. How does your right side feel as you swing back there through the right nostril and the right side, sensing? Was there some space that was untouched by this movement back and forth from left to right to left to right? See now if you can hold simultaneously but separately in consciousness this left side and this right side. Not as one but as two at the same time. What happens when you try to hold the sensations of both sides separately at the same time? Can you feel a space there as you hold both sides in consciousness separately? And then let go and come back into a normal breath, long, deep, and slow, focusing you on your exhales. Feel the shifts that have taken place in consciousness as we went from left to right, back and forth, to both together, to now going back into both nostrils, focusing on the exhale. Now see if you can breathe just into the top half of your body. Focusing all of your awareness into the top half of the body. As we've done before, shift your awareness to the bottom half of your body. Breathing just into the bottom half of your body, however you define top and bottom. Feel how the sensations of the lower half of your body change as you focus your attention there. Again, move back to the top half of the body. Attend to this. Breathe into this top half of the body. And then shift again to the bottom half. Now again, see if you can hold both top half and bottom half separately and simultaneously in consciousness. What happens when you do?
Then let go and come back again into your both nostril breath. Long exhale, smooth, slow, comfortable, slipping away into what? And now finally, see if you can regenerate this left-right top-bottom in consciousness. See if you can hold left-right top-bottom simultaneously in consciousness. Is it possible? Top, bottom, left, right, all at the same time. What happens when you do this? Amongst all these changes, is there something that has not been perturbed, has not been moving, has just been witnessing, being, while this mental manipulation occurred. You can do this same alteration exercise with many different opposites. You can pick sensations like hot and cold. Just trying that, just feel hot. Feel how the very word, the very concept, what hot feels like in body-mind. Sense that sensation. And letting go of hot feel cold. Feel what cold brings forth. What sensations arise with cold. And then move back and forth again between hot and cold. At your own pace. Feel that shift. Hot, cold hot, cold. Try to hold them simultaneously and feel if there's anything that is not changing. You can do these same operations with emotions. Take, for example, joy and sadness. Focus first on joy. Feel joy filling your beingness. Feel joy. Then let go of joy. Feel sadness. And then back to joy again. And then back to sadness. And observe as you've shifted back and forth between joy and sadness, hot and cold, left and right, up and down. There is no great meaning to any of the poles. What really lasts, what endures through this, is this space, this beingness within which these manifest. These are all mental constructs, left, right, up, down, joy, sadness, hot, cold. 
sensations are involved, perhaps. Memories, emotions. At the same time, there is something that is untouched by this movement. Something that is unchanging amongst the changing. Bhagavad Gita verse goes, Samam Sarveshu Bhuteshu Tishtan Tam Parameshvaram. The Atman resist, exists within all of us. Vinishatsva Avinashantam Yapasyati Sapasyati The unchanging amongst the changing, he who sees this, she sees clearly. Thank you.